Hello students now we will be solving memory based questions of gate 19 for more video solution on gate 19 subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click bell icon for instant notification Hello students in this question we are going to solve a question from electrical machines from gate 2019 the question is like this five alternators each 5 M MVA 13.2 kilo volts with 25% of reactance on its own base are connected in parallel to a bus bar the short circuit level in mva at the bus bar is so in the question it is mentioned that five alternators are connected in parallel five alternators and the rating of alternators is given to be 5 mva 13.2 kilovolts and 25% reactance excess therefore in per unit you can write excess as 0.25 per unit therefore alternators with 1 per unit let us say 1 at an angle 0 per uh, at an angle 0 this is the per unit value of voltage rating of the alternator and the per unit impedance is 0.25 per unit five such alternators are connected in parallel with a bus bar two three four and five drawing this is not necessary just to give an idea to you i'm just drawing the circuit diagram these are the five alternators in parallel each having one per unit at an angle zero as voltage one per unit at an angle zero one per unit at an angle zero and 0.25 per unit as its reactance 0.25 0.25 0.25 right all these are connected to a bus bar right and in the question it is asked that the short circuit level in mva at the bus bar is if a short circuit fault occurs at the bus bar between the ground and the bus bar then what is the fault level right so if five such alternators are connected in parallel you can see all these voltages are same which means these can be replaced by a single voltage source like this single voltage source with one per unit as its voltage and five reactances in parallel five reactances in parallel 0.25 divided by 5 you will get 0.05 five reactances in parallel connected to the bus and fault level in mva we need to find out fault level in mva so if you look at the circuit diagram you can get if if is equal to 1 per unit divided by 0.05 that will give you 20 per unit fault current is 20 per unit fault current per unit is is equal to fault mva per unit fault mva per unit you already know this relation fault current per unit is is equal to fault mva per unit therefore fault mva per unit per unit value multiplied by the base value what is the base value base value is 5 mva total fault level in mva that is fault level is equal to base value 5 mva multiplied by multiplied by 20 that is going to give 100 mva therefore the correct answer for this question is 100 mva 
fault level at the bus bar is nothing but 100 MBA, right? If you like, hope you like the video, don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. Thank you.
Hello students, in this question we will be solving a question of electrical machines from GATE 2019. The question is like this, a three phase synchronous motor uh, draws 200 amperes from the line at UPF at rated load. Considering the same line voltage and same load at a power factor of 0.5 lead, how much line current it will draw? So it was said that line current is of 200 amperes. At UPF, UPF means UPF का मतलब क्या है? Volt voltage और current दोनों same phase में रहेंगे. Voltage और current same phase में हैं और current का magnitude 200 amperes है. And therefore the load is V times of I. Cos phi is anyway anyways one vi cos phi is equal to v into 200. अब क्या हुआ? Power factor थोड़ा बढ़ गया था पर load इतना ही रहा. Power factor कितना हो गया? Power, uh, sorry, power factor थोड़ा घट गया था. From one the power factor has been devastated and it has become some point five. Therefore इसके अनुसार power factor के अनुसार load constant रखने के लिए current भी change हो जाएगा. Right? Therefore अब मान लेते हैं नया करंट जो है वो सम i डैश है राइट right? i डैश cos phi v टाइम्स ऑफ i डैश cos phi राइट सो v टाइम्स ऑफ 200 विल बी इक्वल टू v टाइम्स ऑफ i डैश cos phi बिकॉज़ लोड इज कांस्टेंट दिस इज बिकॉज़ लोड इज कांस्टेंट लोड इज अज्यूम टू बी कांस्टेंट देन this V and V gets cancelled, you'll, you'll be getting cos phi is given as cos phi is given as 0 0.5 therefore I dash cos phi is equal to 200 therefore I dash is equal to 200 divided by 0 0.5 that is equal to 400 amperes therefore the correct answer for this question is 400 amperes क्वेश्चन में क्या था क्वेश्चन में एक्चुअली पहले 200 एमपीएस ड्रा कर रहा था इस लोड को मेंटेन करने के लिए अब क्या हुआ पावर फैक्टर थोड़ा घट गया किसी कारण पावर फैक्टर थोड़ा लीडिंग में चला गया और i जो है चेंज हो गया लोड लोड को कांस्टेंट रखने के लिए द i 200 एमपीएस हैज नो चेंज टू i डैश व्हाट इज व्हाट इज i डैश वी गॉट i डैश इज 400 एमपीएस therefore the correct answer for this question will be 400 amperes hope you like the video uh, please uh, hope you like the video don't hope you like the video don't forget to share like and subscribe thank you
हाँ सर